Hey guys, this is Rue Roni K95 here, and welcome to the 2023 edition. No, 22 edition of my. Sorry, I almost said it. Welcome to the 2022 edition of my DVD and Blu ray collection library video series. So, today we're going to be taking a look at something that I have here for this holiday season. We're going to be taking a look at 2000s, 2010s. Christmas in specials, movies, as well as cartoons, and there's also some anime on here for this holiday season. So without any further ado, which is right here right now, let's dive right into this. Today, for this holiday season, on the Physical Media Video Library series. Welcome back. Once again, I wanted to do another video like this particularly because last time we already took a look back on 90s Christmas, especially in specials, movies, TV series, as well as cartoons on there, as well as some anime on there, which I have already taken a look back since yesterday as well, which I haven't done before ever, done before or since as well, especially here because we're getting closer, almost devoted exclusively to my DV to the 2023 edition of my DVD and Blu-ray collection library video series, accordingly, which I have a feel, particularly, of how I wanted to come across for that as well. We'll get to that in this point as well. So today, I'm going to be showcasing what I have here, which is something that I have thought of something different, which I haven't thought of doing one before, which I should have done until now, because I was busy doing my movie review on Scrooged. Like, if you haven't seen my movie review, come check out if you haven't seen it at your leisure at this point. <clears throat> especially in the previous video I have uploaded recently. Today we're going to be showcasing here what I got here are 2000s, 2010 in Christmas, especially in movies, cartoons, specials. And there's also some anime on here, which I haven't thought of doing one like this until now, particularly of how I once I wanted to come across, particularly of how I wanted to come this, particularly as well, particularly, because I know that today is December 21st, because we're getting, because it's Wednesday, and, I'm to, and to, I have a feeling that tomorrow is going to be Thursday, so, which this means, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, there's only four more days left till Christmas, and three more days until Christmas Eve, which I have a feeling particularly as well, because... I wanted to do something a lot more special to be doing as well, particularly as how I can come across for that, of how what you're capable of what I'm doing, and keep it things as well, and this is the real reason why I have to do this as well, as how I wanted to come across as well. So let's go into the category, <clears throat> starting in the 2000s, especially in Christmas specials movies and there's also in some cartoons also in the 2000s because those are the ones that I'm going to be doing as well in between the as well so without any further ado which is right here right now let's dive into what we have here the first one here I got here on the DVD and this is the one that I got on, that my family got me on DVD and this is the one that I wanted to show you what I have. And this one I got is the Polar Express. This is actually what the 2005 DVD release from Warner Home Video on there, by the way. However, there is also the Blu-ray release of this available, in case you're wondering why as well. Yeah, it just shows only the trailer for the film. There's no extras on this DVD whatsoever. Well, you get the point, though, as well. 
even though this was based on the book by Chris Van Ellsberg, and also, I've already done a movie review on this movie, The Polar Express, a while back as well. Like, I have wanted, like, I think I did a review on this movie, like, on Christmas Eve last year, accordingly. Just to give you a little heads up, keep the thoughts for this particularly, perish the thought as well, of how I can wanted to come across for a, a movie like The Polar Express as well. And here, I know it's disc one. I most of this comes with slip covers, like especially on this. And by the way, this is the widescreen edition of the Polar Express. There is also the full frame edition of this movie on DVD. Also, I mean, if you watch this on a flat screen, you'll change your mind of how you could watch this movie on a flat screen, particularly. It would blow your mind as well. Here's the DVD disc of this. But what I kept, what it's inside of, what are my memories that I have right there as well, is the Polar Express ticket on there. Yeah, I cut it out of the back of a cereal box, the Polar Express cereal box, which I remembered when I was a kid as well. Yeah, all the memories as well. I mean, I had to keep this as well, because, why not? Because it's the train ticket as well. Because I think that, despite that, this ser this one's fr from, a, out of a, I cut it out of the back of a cereal box as well, in case you're wondering as well. Which, it's been how many years since I cut this out of a cereal box? I believe it was like 2000. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, two thousand ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, twelve, fifteen, seventeen, two thousand eighteen, fifteen, two thousand nineteen, sixteen, two thousand twenty, seventeen, two thousand twenty one, and eighteen, two thousand twenty two. It's been eighteen. This is cut out of a back of a cereal box, which was eighteen years as well. Wow! It looks like I have been living all the memories as well particularly well and also I do have the video game of the Polar Express on the for the PlayStation 2 like if you want me to do a, like a, a video game review on the Polar Express I'll probably do it at one point as well because I haven't done any video game review videos in a while that's the thing and another movie that I got here on DVD, and this is the second favorite Christmas movie in the 2000s that I have here on DVD, and that is Elf. I had to get this on DVD because why not? I really want to know that this is, has the any film on there, because I think this is part of the New Line Home Entertainment's any film series on there. Which I think this has beyond the movie features, as well as the fun and games, and the DVD ROM content. And this also includes the all access pass features, all on this DVD based content for a movie like Elf as well. And yes, there's only both versions, because this too has some more extras on here. And there's only. I don't understand why that. This DVD has some of the, both versions, the disc one is in anamorphic widescreen format, and disc two is in anamorph, in full frame, full mat, format on there. Because I was, I, when I first got this DVD on DVD, I always thought that, th I thought this movie was supposed to have like, I believe it was, um, particularly in both versions on a flipper disc format. Well, interesting fact, would I have all the memories as well. When I first got this, I thought this was supposed to be on a flipper disc on there with both versions on a flipper disc on here, or which has both versions, the anamorphic widescreen format and the full frame format on there accordingly. 
And also, this also has, I believe it was, has some of the ex more extras on disc 2 on there, which I have a feeling, that's why. And this has a booklet like this on here. And there's only 17 chapters on the back like this for the chapter selection on this particular movie. And yes, this has the any film on there, which you can see this on that DVD as well, where it, it says, play the movie. Choose to enjoy the movie independent of any film, which it features scenes that were shown in theaters in a highest quality picture and sound. And this has any films beyond the movie section, which they're full of added features, and the all-access pass section, which includes the making of Elf and the process of bringing the film to the screen as well. And this has some more ex exclusive content at anyfilm.com. And this also has script to screen in on there. Watch the film while accessing the screenplay. And this also has the DVD ROM instructions on here. Which I didn't know it has that until... There's a lot more on this DVD-based content as well. I'm wondering if that if there's some more extras that were on from, the, from this DVD available on the Blu-ray release. Like, if you're watching this on a widescreen, you'll be blown at that as well. And also, for the movie about Elf, I've already done a movie review on Elf a while back, in case you're wondering as well, particularly... Like, if you haven't seen my movie review on Elf, feel free to check it out on my playlist uh, where I had done my movie reviews at your leisure as well. And another DVD that I have right here, and I'm thinking this is the one that I have that I got here, and that is Cartoon Network Christmas Rocks DVD. This is Volume 2 of the Cartoon Network Christmas Compilation DVDs on here. I do have Volume 1 of the Cartoon Network's Christmas Yuletide Follies Volume 1 DVD, but it's in storage, though. Otherwise, unless you can order it on Amazon or eBay as well, accordingly. Yeah, I have already done a DVD review of this a while back on here as well. There's some on these... Include This also includes... The Ed, Ed, and Eddie's Christmas Special, Jingle, Jingle, Jangle, which is available for the first time on this DVD here. Ever since, I've already done a holiday special review on Ed, Ed, and Eddie's Jingle, Jingle, Jangle a while back as well, because it was a holiday tradition to remember as well. There are some episodes that were set around Christmas time, especially from other shows from Cartoon Network, like Dexter's Laboratory, Courage the Cowardly Dog, I Am Weasel, and Johnny Bravo, Twas the Night. But if I had to pick my favorite episode on that's set around Christmas on every Cartoon Network series, I would... My personal favorite would ought to be Johnny Bravo, Twas the Night Christmas episode, which I'm thinking it's my favorite Christmas episode from Johnny Bravo. Which I think I remember seeing Johnny Bravo on Cartoon Network back in the day as well. As well. In case you're wondering why. If you open this up on here. This has the insert on this as well. And this has some synopsis on the most of these on there as well. Like, if you want to pause this, feel free to read if you want it as well. And there's previews for other titles from Cartoon Network available on DVD as well, in case you're wondering as well. And there you have it, particularly as well, in case you're wondering as well. And finally, to some other Christmas specials as well. Okay, this one here I got on DVD, and this is the one that I got for the first time that I don't have. And this is the one that I really wanted to get for the very first time that I have to own it for my Christmas DVD collection, and that is Charlie Brown's Christmas Tales. Although this is also available in the I, All I Wanted on 
This is also available in the I Want a Dog for Christmas Charlie Brown DVD. But this one includes another one called Is This Goodbye Charlie Brown, particularly on this DVD, or that as well. Even though I've already done videos like this a while back, which I showed you before also as well. And another uh, Peanuts classic on DVD that I have right here, and that is I Want a Dog for Christmas Charlie Brown. This also has Charlie Brown's Christmas Tales, which I've already shown you on DVD that I also own on there. But this also includes the making of A Charlie Brown Christmas on DVD, which is hosted by Whoopi Goldberg. Of how there was the his fascinating look on the history of this Christmas special, like um, A Charlie Brown Christmas on this particular DVD as well. Okay, for the things on here in the 2000s as well, I do have these as well, particularly, because I have something for movies, cartoons, and some specials on here as well, uh, accordingly of how I wanted to come across for this as well, in the 2000s as well. And finally to the 2010s on there as well, and this is the one that I really wanted to showcase there as well, finally to the anime that I have right here, which this also includes an episode that is set around Christmas on, on this complete series set on my on the DVD Blu-ray combo, and that is Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, the complete series. I think that this is also including a Christmas episode where Toru and her friends were also attending that Christmas show thing which presented it for the elders at the retirement home in that episode as well. Just to give a little synopsis about that as well. Because I paid like 30 bucks on Amazon online as well. Why not? Because it's going to be living inside your anime collection like a newer title as well. How much did I pay for this? 30 bucks on Amazon Prime, which is a good thing. This has a slip cover like this. But this has the DVD features on here. However, there is also the complete series of this available also on Blu-ray, which I think that's part of Funimation Essentials on there, in case you're wondering, of how I wanted to come by for this as well, for a DVD like Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid, as how I wanted to come across for this as well accordingly as how I can understand for the fact of how you can come by on this as well here's this as well and this is basically how I wanted to own this one as well particularly of how I want to do this as well even though I've already done a DVD blu-ray combo review of this a while back this at all has got to me though as well but I haven't watched this in a while Rewatched it in a long time because maybe I rewatched it 25 times though. However, there is also a reversible cover on this one as well. Okay, the green D DVD discs, I'm thinking that's probably the DVD, but the blue disc ones on here, which I'm guessing that ha that might have been the Blu ray, if I'm not mistaken, as well. So yeah, here. In case you're wondering as well. So basically, disc one ha only covers about seven episodes on here. Disc two only covers episodes 18 to 13 on here, which I'm guessing this also includes the OVA episode on here, which is only dubbed in Japanese, but English subtitled only. Which is my theory, though, in case you're wondering. So, yeah. All on this DVD Blu-ray-based content for a complete series set like Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid as well. Particularly what I wanted to learn about this accordingly as well. I believe that's the, the reason why I had to do this one as well. Because that's the thing of how I wanted to come across for this as well. For all sorts as well. So, 
I got this recently for my anime collection, that's why. Because I had to do this for the video. And I think I did mention that Christmas episode on anime retrospect, where I'm ranking the Christmas episodes, uh, especially on these episodes that were, I believe, set around Christmas time, that's why. As well. As well. Because if you want to see for more videos on there, be sure to check the, the, the previous videos. Those, if you want to check them out at your leisure. Excuse me. Be sure to check out the videos at your leisure at this point. Because I have done videos like these a while back. This has got to the point, as far as I know as well, and also, I have done my previous anime update video where I did the ones about how these episodes that were set around Christmas, specifically in anime OVAs or on TV, uh, condensed movie versions, as well as episodes set around Christmas in anime television series. Doesn't matter if it's from the 80s, 90s, as well as the 2000s, or even the early 2010s as well accordingly, which I can understand for the fact of how I can remember it all. Well, at least I have remember it all as well, particularly. At least my brain is not even mushed up as well, because I have done videos like those a while back as well, because I had to do it for every holiday season, just to have to do something for the holidays, especially for the whole month as well, accordingly, as how I can do videos like this as well. Well, this is the first time I wanted to do this one particularly as well. So that's going to be it for my video here for today on the 2022 edition of my DVD and Blu-ray collection library video series for today, you guys. Thank you for watching, but before we go, here's what I'm going to say for this one. Wow, this is the first time I wanted to do a video like this one as well, because why not? Because I wanted to do a video like this for the very first time as well, because just in... in get, just in time because Christmas is definitely around the corner on Christmas Eve on Saturday and Sunday is the 25th on Christmas Day as well because Christmas is definitely four days around the corner left around the corner as how I can do this as well well this is the first I uh, ever since I've already covered on 80s Christmas and movies and anime as well as 90s Christmas in I believe specials, movies, TV series, as well as cartoons, and some there's some anime on there which I've already covered a while back as well, but this is the first time I want to cover 2000s, 2010s movies, cartoons, specials, and even some anime on there for this video as well, accordingly, of how I can learn for this as well. Hope to subscribe for content, my anime pilot link in the description down below, let me know your uh, oh, Patreon links in the description down below. And also, if you want to let me know your thoughts in the comments in the comment section below, just let me know if you like as well. And also, be sure to smack the like button if you enjoyed the video as well. And also, be sure to like, think, click on the subscribe button. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, RuroniK95. Feel free to join my channel, especially if you're new to my channel as a newcomer. Smack the notifications bell button. Be sure to get notified also as well for more latest updates on here. Because I have been making a lot of videos like this just to get your little head started off really like quick as well. Particularly of how I can come across for this as well particularly. And I always want to do videos like these every holiday season as well. Just in time for the holidays as well. And that's all what I got for today. This is Ruroni K95 saying thank you for watching my video and I'm glad you liked it. I hope you enjoy it. Hope to see you soon for the next video. Hope you have a great day. This is Ruroni K95 signing off. Thank you for watching my video and I will see you soon for more videos. Take care. Bye.